Good afternoon. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. How are you? I'm okay, teacher. And you? I'm pretty good, thank you. It's good to see everybody or the, well, many of you. Okay. Hello, um, I see new faces. Hello, uh, Flor Noyola. How are you? Hello, I'm fine. And you? Good, good. Thank you. Um, all right. You you were not here yesterday, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, well, welcome. And um, also, yeah, I see some new faces there. Um, Luis Eduardo. Hi, teacher. Este, uh, I'm going to uh, activate the, my camera mm -hmm. a few moments because I, I'm going, I am eating my lunch. Oh, I see. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to ask you to turn on your camera uh, for the attendance, because for the attendance, I, I really do need the camera on, okay? All right? Okay, yeah, only five minutes. Okay, very good. Um, just give me a moment. Okay. Um, hey, I'm I'm glad we 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 have more more students connecting. Um, let me just uh, write to the group, make sure that that you are um, that everybody knows. Okay. All right. All right. Very good, everybody. Um, so welcome. Um, so le voy a pedir um, a Flor Noyola y al, quiero ver quién más, Lucas Hernández. Sí, solamente ellos dos. Eh, les voy a pedir que se me hacen el favor de cambiar su nombre en la plataforma para que se aparezca su nombre completo. Ok, no sé si ya saben cómo hacer eso. Yes, no. Chicos, yes, no. Do you know how to do that? ¿Ya saben cómo hacer eso o todavía no? Eh, yes, sí, teacher. Ok, ok, excelente. Ah, perfecto, ya, yeah, hoy sí, ya la, la veo su nombre completo. Eh, Lucas, ¿sabe usted cómo hacer eso? No sé si me escucha, Lucas. Yes, teacher, ya lo voy a hacer. Ok, perfecto, gracias. Ok, eh, hello, Sandra Chávez. Eh, hello, hello. Welcome. Thank Bienvenida. you. Okay, very good. Ya veo que ya cambió su nombre. Thank you very much. Yeah, okay. Okay, excellent. Okay. Um, bueno, muchas gracias ahí por conectarse, chicos, a tiempo. También les, um, les pido que si podemos encender la camarita, uh, al menos que ahí tengan alguna situación, ¿verdad? Que, que haya, me haya avisado por la que, um, por la que no pueden activar ahorita su cámara, pero de lo contrario, deben de tener su cámara encendida. 
¿ok? Um, quiero uh, asegurarme, ustedes ya se, um, todos tienen acceso a la plataforma, todos han podido ingresar y empezar a hacer ejercicios. ¿Sí? ¿No? Yes, sí. Teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay. Any questions in this moment about the platform? A anything at all? No? No questions at all? No questions. No? Okay, okay, very good. Okay, um, by a solo, if I can ask Flor y Marcela and Luis, if you can turn on your camera, please. I really appreciate that. Sé que Carla tiene ahí una circunstancia, pero de lo contrario, todos se me pueden hacer ese favor. Okay. All right, perfect, thank you. Okay, so what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna start with attendance and we need the camera on for the attendance. So please, please um, keep it on so that we don't have any problems. Uh, okay, so we're gonna start. Please tell me, like if you hear your name, just um, open up your cam, your, sorry, your, your microphone, say, um, uh, you know, present, and then you can turn off your camera. Uh, sorry, sorry, your microphone, your microphone. Uh, turn off your microphone so that we don't have interference with the um, with with the different sounds. Okay. All right. So we're going to start with uh, Brenda Melissa Linares. Yes, teacher. Okay. Present. All right. Good. All right. Excellent. Yeah. You just you just need to say present, and I, I will take note that you are present. Okay. Very good. Okay. Um. Uh, Flor Maria Noyola. Present teacher. Very good. Excellent. Uh, Jose Ricardo Teresón. I'm here, teacher, present. All right, excellent. Thank you. Josué Ernesto Campos. Josué Ernesto Campos. Not here? Okay. All right. Um, so, Carla Sofía Nieto. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Um, Loida Eunice Lopez. All right, very good. Lucas David Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay, uh, can we turn on the camera? for the attendance. Okay, wonderful, thank you very much. Okay, Luis Eduardo Castaneda. Present. Uh, Mr. I'm here. Oh, okay. Uh, is it possible to turn on the camera for the attendance? Yes, uh, wait me, uh, five minutes, please. Eh, solamente necesito para la asistencia, porque de lo contrario no puedo tomar la asistencia, por, porque es parte de los requisitos. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, Marcela del Carmen Pozo. Hello, present. All right, thank you very much. Um, Marcos Antonio Torres. Marco Antonio Torres. Not here, Marco Antonio. Marcos Antonio. Okay, uh, Maria Violeta Cañada. 
María Violeta Cañada. ¿No? Uh, Mario Edgardo Contreras. Mario Edgardo Contreras. Melquia Donía Rivas Díaz. Present. All right, wonderful. Nuria Marilu Monroy. Present. Mm, está, no la vi. Nuria Marilu. No, ¿verdad? No está. Ok. Uh, Ricardo Antonio Molina. Ricardo Antonio Molina. No, tampoco. Ok. Uh, Sandra María Chávez. Ok, very good. William Ernesto Orellana. Present teacher. Excellent. Uh, Jensi Lisette Abrego. Jensi Lisette Abrego. Okay. Uh, Yesenia Patricia Pérez. Yen, eh, Yen, Yesenia Patricia Pérez. Ok. Y Jonathan Guillermo Sayada. Jonathan Guillermo Sayada. Ok. Va. Voy a, a repetir los nombres que no escuché que hayan dicho que están conectados. Josué Ernesto Campos. Marco, Marcos Antonio Torres. María Violeta Cañada, Mario Edgardo Contreras, uh, Nuria Marilu Monroy, eh, Ricardo Antonio Molina, Jensi uh, Lisset Ábrego, Yesenia Patricia Pérez y Jonathan Guillermo Seguera. ¿Es correcto? ¿Ninguno de ellos está? Correcto, no están. Ok, perfecto. Ok. Eh, bueno, les uh, primeramente les agradezco a los que um, se han conectado. Um, gracias ahí por, por haberse conectado a tiempo y en especial a aquellos que no estuvieron en clase ayer, ¿verdad? Eh, pero pues ya se lograron conectar. Um, ayer hablamos acerca de la importancia de poder uh, conectarse a tiempo porque eso... Eh, va a, recuperar, eh, eh, va a, a afectar su asistencia eh, en la nota final porque necesitan un 80% de tanto de nota como de asistencia para poder pasar. Entonces eh, es muy, muy, muy importante que ustedes estén en clase, que no falten a más de lo, de lo necesario para que podamos tener suficiente eh, asistencia para poder pasar. Acuérdense que solo son ocho clases, solamente ocho clases. Entonces, eh, si usted ya perdió una clase, eso ya es el, eh, el 12.5% de, del curso. Entonces, significa de que um, ya casi estamos, eh, ya, ya casi cerca de, de, de ese, ese margen que, que usted tiene para poder uh, faltar. ¿verdad? Entonces, significa de que si usted faltó ayer, por favor, haga todo lo posible para no faltar más, porque de lo contrario eh, puede estar en peligro de no, no pasar. Ok, entonces aseguremos estar conectados a, a la hora y toda la clase y que también estemos aquí en todas las clases de aquí en adelante. Ok, por supuesto, hay razones de fuerza muy mayor que no permiten estar conectados eh, en todas las clases, pero hagamos el mayor intento posible para que podamos nosotros eh, pues ayudarles y, y así ustedes pueden pasar con facilidad al próximo nivel. ¿Tienen ustedes alguna pregunta o duda sobre eso?
No, ninguna. Ok. Ok, ¿todo está claro? Todo claro. Perfect. Ok, wonderful. All right, so what we're going to do then, we're going to start with our class. And I want to know if you can see my screen. Can you see the screen? Yes. Okay, very good. Can you ask can you ask me in English? Do you want to can you ask me that question in English? Uh, who patch the number patch this? What what page? Um I'm not sure. Let me check what page it is. Just to be honest, I'm not sure. Mm, 37. We're on page 37. Okay, so today we're going to be talking a little bit about family. Okay. So here we have um, a, let's say, typical family, okay? It's, uh, the family consists of four people. There is the father, okay? So here's the father. Here is the mother, okay? Now, the father and the mother are married. Okay, they're married. It's dun, dun, ta -dun, dun, dun, ta -dun. They're married, okay? So because they're married, the father is the husband and the mother is the wife. Okay? All right, do we understand that? Yes, yeah? I understand that. Okay. Good. So we have husband and wife. Can you repeat that for me? Husband. 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 Okay. And wife. And wife. And wife. Mm -hmm. and wife. Very wife. good. Okay. Excellent. Now, it's not husband. So be careful with that. It's not husband. It's husband. Ha, husband. husband. Yeah. Okay. All right. And it's wife. Not wife. It's wife. Okay. Can you repeat after me? Wife. 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 Mm -hmm. wife. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Now, <clears throat> uh, we also have father. 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 And mother. 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 Can you repeat? Father. 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 And mother. And mother. mother. Okay, very good. Excellent. Um any questions about the vocabulary here? Any questions? No questions. No? No. Okay. All right, very good. Um, now, father and mother, they had children. Okay, they had children. And so, oh, by the way, yeah, so they had children. And because they had children, they became parents. Parents. Yeah, they became parents. What are parents? Parientes. No. 
Padres. Padres. Very good. Okay, exactly. They became parents. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Um now eh, so they had a boy. Okay, they had a boy, and the boy is now the son. So the the father had a son, the mother had a son. Okay. Do we understand? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Yeah. I understand. Okay. All right. Very good. Now, they also had a girl, and she became their daughter. Okay. No. Daughter. All right. All right, any questions about that? No? Why he is son and she is daughter? Um, because the son is the boy, the baby boy, baby. And the daughter is a baby girl. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. Very good. Now, um, they the two of them, the the two of them became their children. Their children. Okay. So the two are the children. So what is what is son in Spanish? Hijo. Hijo. Mm -hmm. oh, very good. Uh-huh. Very good. Hijo. And what is daughter? Yes. Hija. 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 Very good. Hija. Exactly. Okay. Now, um, and what is child children? What is children? Is plural. Sorry? Is in plural. Children is for the children. Sorry. Es para los dos y para niños, si no me equivoco. Children. Solo eso tengo una duda. Perdón, dice. Porque este, ¿cuál es la diferencia entre children y kids? Porque... Okay. What, so, what is the difference between, ask me in English, mm -hmm. what is the okay. difference between children and kids? What is the difference between children and kids? Okay, children is the more formal way, kids are informal. Okay. Okay. All right. So what are, in, in general, when you say they are my children, what do you mean by that? What does that mean? Porque se está refiriendo al, al hijo propio. Uh -huh. But when, when you say they are my children, they are my children. What does what does that mean? They are my children. Ellos son mis hijos. Okay. Ellos son mis hijos. Very good. Okay. All right. Now, um, now the son and the daughter have a relationship okay they have a relationship between them okay um hold on. give me a... so um they have they have a relationship um hold on okay so the son and the daughter have a relationship. The relationship that they have is that the son is the brother and the daughter is the sister. 
Okay. So the, 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 the relationship that they, the two of them have, he is the brother and she is the sister. Okay. So now, so what is brother? What is Hermano. brother? Hermano. Hermano. Very good. Excellent. And what is sister? Hermano. 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 Hermana. Exactly. Okay. Excellent. Now, I want you to uh, repeat after me. Husband. 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 Oh, sorry. Give me a second. Okay. Wife. 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 Father. 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 Mother. 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 Parents. Parents. Good. Son. Son. Daughter. Daughter. Children. 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 Brother. Brother. Sister. Sister. Okay. Good. All right. Now, also keep in mind that these people have names. Okay. So they have, so the husband's name is Paul. The wife's name is Anne. The brother's name is Jason. The, the sister's name is Emily. So what we're going to do is we're going to complete the information here about, about the family using the diagram. Okay, so we are going to say, for example, Anne and Paul, Anne, so Anne is here. Okay. Eh, Tal vez podemos cerrar todos los micrófonos, por favor. Thank you. All right. So, um, so Anne, <clears throat> Anne is this woman here, and she is Paul's. So, what is the relationship between Anne and and Paul? She is Anne's what? Husband and wife. Yes, but Anne is Paul's what? Wife. Wife, exactly. Anne is Paul's wife. What does that mean in Spanish? Esposa. Uh -huh. but, but give me the sentence. Anne is Paul's wife. Anna is la esposa. Good. Anna is la esposa de... Bueno, si lo vamos en español sería como Pablo, right? Okay. Ana es la esposa de Pablo. Do we understand? Yes. yes. Yeah? Okay. Very good. Um, um, good, good, good. Okay. Um, what, so we're going to complete this using this diagram. Okay. Um, oh, by the way, um, here is the question that you were asking me. Here's the answer to the question. So what's the difference? We, right here. So kids is, is informal for children. Mom is informal for mother. And dad is informal for father. Okay. So... Uh, so kids, like, yeah, I have, you can say they are my kids. It means they are my children. Uh, she is my mom, means she is my mother. He is my, my dad, it means he is my father. Okay, so um, what is mom in Spanish? 
Mama. Mama. Mama and mother? Madre. 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 What is dad? Papa. 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 And what is father? Padre. 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 Good. Excellent. Uh, Luis Eduardo, you, did you have a question? Have I have it? Oh, I, uh -huh. So uh, it's the same kids and children uh, just... Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's informal and children is the it's formal. Uh, formal. Hmm? It is uh, informal and the uh, and children is uh, the formal form. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Okay. All right. Perfect. So I'm going to stop sharing and I'm going to uh, share this um this picture with um with everybody with in the group okay so um please tell me if you if you receive the picture De hecho, uh, me acabo de acordar de algo, chicos. Um, perdón. Oops, no, perdón. Perdón, chicos. Me equivoqué, lo mandé. Ah, ok. Un okay. okay, hoy sí creo que debería de llegarles. Sí. Yes, no. Yes. Okay. Very good. Yes. Oh, excellent. Okay, so I'm going to send you. So now you have the you have the diagram, and now I'm sending you the exercise. Okay. Do you have it? Yes. Everybody has it. Yes, no, chicos, necesito ahí que me, que me indiquen. Yes, no? Yes. Okay, yes. good. All right, I'm going to divide you right now into groups. Uh, I just want to make sure that everybody is here. William Ernesto, are you here? William Ernesto, are you there? No? Okay. All right. Let us see. Luis Eduardo? Sorry, teacher. Estaba revisando el, oh, la imagen. Okay. 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 Good. Sí. All right. So it's okay. Luis Eduardo is here. Perfect. Okay. So I'm going Yo to. Okay. But I'm going to right now put you in the, into the breakout rooms. So I'm opening the rooms right now. Loida?
no le escucho. Tive el micrófono. Ah, ahí está. Vaya, entonces la número dos sería Jason en Emily. Are their children sería. Are they? ¿Qué es there? Are they? Son su, sus, creo. Jason en Arte. Jason en Arte. Children, ajá. Children sería. Oh, daughter, no va. Daughter sí. es como hija. ¿Y parents qué era? Padres. Ah, pues sería children. Ajá, sería children. All is, no, is any, all is any, is, dice Paul, es, el, Paul es, husband, sería, es el esposo de Anne. All is, Paul y Ana. Ajá, Paul. Pero también tiene la otra, el, la Ana. Paul y Ana. Husband y wife, no. Ajá, pero como en la de arriba ya estaba, que es la esposa, va. Ajá. Entonces aquí me imagino que es husband. Husband. Ajá. No sé, digo yo. Bueno, así pongámoslo. Husband. Jason is an is. Jason is an is. Jason is the son. Es el hijo. Jason is the son. The end. Ajá. Sí, sí. Jason is an son. Emily is his daughter. His daughter, ajá. Uh -huh. Jason dice is Emily brother ba. Sí. Jason is brother. Brothers. Brother. La siete sería sister. Emily. Jason. Sister sería ahí. Ajá. Sister. Dice Paul en Va. Brother. Uh -huh. Sí, ahí serían hermanos. Brother. No, J Brother. Jason. De Emily, herman, hermano. Ajá. Ah, es el hermano Brother. de Emily. Y Emily y este Jackson. Jason es la cosa. Ajá, eh, Emily. Eh, sister. Son, son hermanos. No, es que ahí lo dice. Jason es de Emily, hermano. Uh -huh. Brother. Brother. By the way, dice que Emily es de Jason, hermano. Hermana. Uh -huh. Yo entiendo que es como que le están preguntando qué es Emily de Jason. Ajá, sería la hermana o a las siete. Y sí. ahí dice Paul y Ann son de Jason. Son sus parents. O Ajá, sea, sería padres. parents. Uh -huh, la última es parents. Ahí está. Sí, va. Entonces, la, la dos sería Songba. 
Ajá, yo soy un repuesto. La tres, husband. La cuatro son. Ajá, la cuatro son. Cinco daughter. La cinco daughter. La seis, seis brother. brother. La siete, sister. Uh -huh. Y la ocho, parents. Uh -huh. Así es. Ahí estamos, entonces. Está bueno. Ok. Solo los otros dos eran. Hola. Solo dos. ¿Estás listo, right? Hello? You ready? You ready? I'm ready. Perfect. Uh, okay. I'll see you in a moment in the main room. Okay. See you in a moment. Um, are you ready or do you need more time? Hello? Are you ready or do you need more time? Finished, teacher. You're finished? Yes. yes. Ah, perfect. Okay. In that case, um, I will I will bring everybody back, okay? I'll see you in the main room. Can you hear me? Okay. Class, can you hear me? Escuchan? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. All right, perfect. I'll, I'll bring you to the main room in a moment. Okay. I'll, I'll take you back to the main room. Hola. ¿Me escuchan o no? Yes. ¿Sí? Yes. Okay. Yes. So I will take you back to the main room. Do, do you understand? Yes. Yes? Yes. Se me está cortando o, o no sé por qué. ¿No, no me escuchan bien? Sí, escucha bien. ¿Se, ¿Se escucha bien? Sí. Ok, ok. Es que como le estaba haciendo una pregunta y no me respondían, entonces pensé que quizás no me escuchaban. Ok, so, do you understand? I will take you back to the main room. Main room. The main room. Right now, breakout rooms. But bring back to main room, principal room. Flor, do you understand? Eh, que salgamos de los grupos pequeños, Yeah, I will. I will bring you back. Okay, we'll bring Ay, you. Que regresemos al grupo uh -huh. principal. I I will bring you back. Okay. 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 All right. Just a moment. Okay, so uh, we're going to be checking the answers. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to give me the answers. Okay, 
please tell me if you can see my power, my, my, my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes. yes. Perfect. Yes. Okay. All right. So. Um, Anne is Paul's wife. We already know that, right? Now, Jason, Jason, bueno, quizás, vamos a hacer, vamos a hacer lo mejor así para que podamos ver mejor. Yeah, okay. So, Jason and Emily, because this is Jason and this is Emily. So, Jason and Emily are there. Children. Very children. good. Children. Are there children? Son sus hijos. Right? Now, Paul is Anne's husband. 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 Very good. Jason is Anne's husband. Excellent. Emily, Emily here is Paul's daughter. Daughter, very good, excellent. Daughter. Okay. Number six. Jason is Emily's brother. 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 Good. Jason is Emily's brother. Emily is Jason's sister. 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 Good. And Paul and Anne are Jason's parents. Parents. Okay, good. Yeah, exactly. We we pronounce it parents. Pair. Parents. Okay. All right. Any questions? No, no, teacher. Teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. The correct pronunciation is ants or ants. Yes, ants. Correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. Yeah. Um, Any other questions? No. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Very good. Now we're going to be talking about um, we're going to be talking about the present simple. The present simple is <clears throat> the present simple is used when we are talking about um, things that are true. Okay, things that are always true. Do we understand true? Real. Yeah. Eh, yeah, true. Um, Verdadero. Verdadera, ciertas, okay? So things that are always true, okay? <clears throat> to give you an example, to give an example, I can say, um, I am a teacher. This is true. I am a teacher. Okay. I can say you are not. Um, for example, you are not. Mm, I don't know, Russian. You are not Russian. Okay. Ustedes no son rusos, right? So it's true. They're not Russian. So things that are that are always true, okay? So <clears throat> there are two things you have to know about the about the verb uh, about the present simple. The first is that um, the most common or that we have learned so far is when we're using the verb to be, okay? So like, like I said, I am a teacher. You are not Russian, okay? He is tall. He is tall, 
Okay, so I can write this down so you can see what I'm talking about. So I can say I am a teacher. You are not, or also I can say aren't, Russians. Or she, um, he is Paul. Él es alto. Okay? So these are things that are true. Okay? And in these ones, if you notice, we're using... We're using the verb to be. Okay. Any questions? No? No, no question. No. Okay, so here, so if you notice, we are going to always use a subject. We always start with a subject, with the affirmative and the negative. So for example, you say I, you in the negative, and then he also in the affirmative. Yeah, then we use the verb to be. So we used one of these, right? Am, is, are. You here we used am, here we use is. Or the negative, am, is, are, not. Like here, are, not, or aren't. Okay. Then after that, we use the predicate. The predicate is also another name for complement. Okay, the predicate or the complement. Okay. All right. Oh, sorry. We're not going to talk about that yet. So we have, I am a teacher. That The teacher is the predicate. You aren't Russians. Russians is the predicate. Okay. Vamos bien? Do we understand? Okay. Yeah. No questions, any, any questions, or better said, any questions at this moment? Um, predicate is the same to, to complement. complement. Yeah, complement. Mm -hmm. Okay. Same. Okay. Now, in the questions, if you're asking questions, we're going to start with am, is, or are. Okay. So we can say, for example, <clears throat> we can say, are you, oh, let me see. Let's change. Are they, are they um, in the house? Are they in the house? Okay. So if you notice, we are always going to start with M is or R. Okay, M is or R. So that's why we started with R, R. Okay, right there. After that, then we're gonna be using the subject. In this case, we used they. And finally, we can use the predicate, right? So in this question, we used in the house. That's the predicate. Okay. So far, so good?
Any questions at this moment? No, teacher. Oh. No? Okay. All right, perfect. Now, that is for the verb to be. Wait, perdona, send me. Okay. Esta. Okay, that is for the verb to be. Ay, no sé qué pasó acá. No sé por qué no. Okay. All right, so. Um, All right, so we have here a, for other verbs that are not the verb to be, then we it's a little different, okay? For example, we can say... Por ejemplo, podemos decir... She lives in Santa Tecla. She lives in Santa Tecla. Okay? We are not using the verb to be. We're using another verb. What is the verb that we are using? Live. Live. Very good. So we're using the, the verb live. In Spanish, what is live? Vivir. Vivir. Very good. So she lives in Santa Tecla. Ella vive en Santa Tecla. Okay? Or we can make negatives here. Okay? For example, we can say... Um, we... Oh, hold on. Se me acabo de... Me acabo de dar cuenta de algo. All right. Or we can also say, for example, um, we don't work um, in an office. We don't work in an office. What In this case, what is the verb that we use? Work. Right. Very good. We're using the verb work. Okay. So it's not the verb to be. So with all the verbs to be, we use this structure. But with all the other verbs, we use like this. Okay? So the structure for this, we start with we start with the subject. In this case, we have she is a subject and we, right? After that, with, with when affirmative, we use a verb, like in this case, lives. Okay? We use the verb lives. Oh, sorry. Okay. Um, all right, so um, then in the negative, we use don't, or sorry, um, yeah, we use don't or doesn't, depending on the subject. So if we are using I, you, we, or they, we use don't. But if we're using she, it, or he, we use doesn't. In this case, we use don't,
because we're using we. So we don't. We don't, and then we use the verb in the original form. No change, it's the base form. Okay. Okay, um, actually here, I don't want to confuse you. So I'm just going to change this, make it simple and I'm just gonna say compliment. Okay, so ignore that it says here object and I'm gonna change it to compliment so that we don't get confused. Okay. Any questions about that? Yo tengo una, pero no sé cómo formulársela en inglés. Okay, try. Try try to yeah. ask in English. Try. Inténtalo mm -hmm. In the in the example to mm -hmm. the verbs. Mhm. Mm in the first example, uh, say she lives. Mm -hmm. y, um, lleva la S al final, ¿por qué? Y en la otra ya no, en, la, en el otro ya no lleva, solo dice work. So, in the, in the first one, ¿cómo dice lleva la S? She lives. No, how do you say in English, lleva la S? Uh -huh. How um lleva um <laughs> ¿Cómo, cómo se dice S S the okay. letter S okay in the there, there word, is the letter S word, in the word lips okay lips uh -huh. yeah we'll talk about that I will answer that in a moment okay that's a very very good question and I will and I will answer that question in a moment but first I want to finish talking about this and then I will answer that question is that okay Carla so first mm. I will explain this and then later I will explain the that that question. okay 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 but very good question okay so we have the complement uh, after, in the end, we have the complement, okay? Uh, so in this case, Santa Tecla, in this case, in an office. And that's how you make, you make affirmative and negative of other verbs. Now, for, for the questions, we can say, for example, does, um, it work. Um, does it work well? Does it work well? Example. Does it work well? Okay, so here, to begin with, we always use, to make a question, we use do or does. That's why here we're using does. So do we use for I, you, we, and they. Okay, so you say, do I, do you, do we, do they, okay? We, for does, we use with he, she, and it. So in this case, we're using does because if you notice, the, the subject 
is the subject that we have here is it. So that's why we use does it. We do not say do it. We say does it. Okay? It's clear? Yes, no, maybe. It's okay? It's clear? So yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay, good. After that, we use the verb. Okay? We use the verb. In this case, the verb is? What is the verb? Work. Work. Very good. The verb is work. Okay? And then we use a complement. Okay, we can use a complement. And in this case, the complement is well. So when you say, what does it work well? What is the question in Spanish? Does it work well? Bien. Well, bien. Uh -huh, but the question, does it work well? Funciona bien. Exactly. Funciona bien. Funciona bien. That's the question. Okay. All right. Any questions about this in this moment? No? Yes, I have a question. Okay, yes. Uh, what is your question? What does it mean uh, DS? Does. What does it mean DS? Does. Not the yes, does. C can you repeat? Does. What does it mean? It does. Does mean S. S? In, in your question and your example, uh, you have the letter S, mass, bear, mass, complement. Oh, subject. The, yeah, yeah, sub, yeah, the letter S is short for subject. Ah, okay, subject. Thanks. Subject, yeah, subject. Okay. All right, any other questions in this moment? Ya, ya voy a responder esa pregunta de la S, pero uh, lo que hemos visto hasta el momento, quiero saber. Any questions until this moment? No. Okay. What I will do, I will I will take um I I will uh, I, I will um copy and send this to the group. But I can't say I'm as fácil de poder acordarse. Sounds good? Okay, um, I'm going to send it to the group right now. Okay, do you have it? I just sent it right now. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. okay, good. Now I will answer the question about the S. Okay, right now you should see a white screen. Do you see white? Yes. Okay, good. You should see white. No se, no se preocupen. Si no ven nada es porque debe estar blanco. Okay, so. I'm going to write here. We're going to be using the verb live. Okay. Um, live. What is live? What does live mean? Vivir. Vivir. 
be reader. Okay, good. Excellent. Everybody knows that. Good. Okay, so if I say I, we have the 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 subjects you, a, she, he, it, we, you plural, right? I'll put I'll, I'll put this one to you singular so you know. And then they. Okay. So this is the this is the um let's say the um the the, the subjects, okay? After that we would put the verb, okay? We have the verb to be. Sorry, it's, it's the verb live, sorry, the verb live. So I'm going to write here the verb live. Okay. So live, 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 and live. Okay. So we put the subject. So this is going to be the subject. Okay. And then here we have the verb. Okay. The thing is that um, we always use in the, the simple present, we always use the base form of the verb. So I live, you live, it live, sorry, we live, you plural live, they live. The only difference, the only one that are the exception is for, for these ones here. For she, he, and it. These are the ones that are the exception. Okay, so for these ones, we're going to be adding an S. Okay, so because it's he, she, it, we, they, third person singular, we're going to add an S. So we're going to say, I live, you live, she lives, he lives, it lives, we live, you live, they live. Okay, does that make sense? Do we understand? Yes, I understand. Yes. Yes. Any questions you want to ask? It's only the bird leaves. No, 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 no. All the verbs in the simple present. All the verbs. Okay. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so um, normally we're going to just put an S. So if uh, to give you, I'll give you another verb. If the verb was um, play. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about play. So in this case, it would be, I play, you play, she, oh, yeah, let me say that a moment. Okay, so here we're, we're gonna be using another verb. The verb is gonna be play, okay? Okay, so in this case, so you say, I play, you play, and for she, he, and it, we're going to say, she plays, he plays, it plays. Does that make sense? 
So only for she, he, and it. Does that make sense, everybody? Yeah. Only, only for the third person. Only for and the third person, add, singular, singular. We add um, S, the final to, yes. to verb. Yes, exactly. After the verb, we put an S. Correct. OK, thank you. Okay. You're welcome. Any more questions? Okay, now, so this is with all the verbs, we're in the simple present, third person singular, she, he, it, we use, we put the S. But there are verbs that, for example, there's, so the majority, you just put an S, the majority. But there are other verbs, for example, watch. Okay. Watch is another type of verb that with these ones, it's a little bit different. It's a little bit different. Um, so you say, I watch, 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 watch. What is watch? Es cierto. Ver. Ajá, uh -huh, very good. Ver, mirar. It's actually more mirar. like mirar. It's more like mirar, yeah. Okay. All right, so watch, 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 watch. Okay. But with these ones, what happens is we're not just going to put an S. Not just an S. We're going to put ES. Okay. So... You're going to say, eh, watches. So he what? So I watch, you watch, she watches, he watches, it watches, and that's it. Only for those. Okay. So the, these ones are like the, let's say like the exception. And the reason is because, um, and the reason is because um, with verbs that finish, the verbs that finish in the letters ch, sh, ss, um, x, z, usually z, e, o. With these ones, you're going to uh, have this, um, this exception. Okay? Todos los, todos los verbos que terminan con, con esas letras. Okay? So watch finishes with CH. So that's why we put ES. Does that make sense? Do we understand that? Yes or no? Yes, no, maybe, Quentin. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yeah? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Perfect. And I'm going to teach you one more. One more rule. The rule is verbs, for example, that uh, finish in a consonant and Y. For example, fly. <laughs> Uh 
Okay, so um, for this one, with for fly, we have, so I, so we have I fly, no clue, fly, 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 and fly. Do you understand fly? Volar. 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 Okay. Excellent. So you say, I fly, you fly, we fly, you fly, plural, they fly. But with the with um he, she, and it, what happens is that we do something different. We eliminate the why. Okay. So with these ones, we eliminate the why. No why. Okay, we eliminate it. And we eliminate it because we change the Y to an I. Okay, so we change the Y to an I. And, and then after we add ES. Yeah, so we say. So we end up like this. Okay. She flies, he flies, it flies. Okay. Do we understand? I understand. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, re so remember that it's when, when the verb finishes in Y. Only Y. Yes. I have y. a question. Okay. Uh-huh. Yes. Good. What is your question? Why do you change the Y for I? Uh, because um, the thing is that okay, se los voy a explicar de esta forma, se los voy a explicar en español. No sé si, creo que, no sé si, si ya les había explicado, no me acuerdo muy bien, um, si ya les había explicado que a veces la Y en inglés se considera una vocal. ¿Ya, le, ya habíamos hablado acerca de eso? En la, en la última clase del módulo 1, creo que... Uh -huh. o última, sí. pero no todos estábamos en la misma clase. Ajá, correcto, correcto. Entonces, um, si sí, algunos ya, ya saben esto, otros quizás todavía no, entonces les explico. Sí, eh, entonces, en inglés, la Y a veces eh, eh, se, se utiliza como una vocal, como por ejemplo en fly. En fly, si ustedes notan, no hay otra vocal. Entonces, la Y hace la función de una vocal. ¿Ya? Pero, si yo mantengo, el problema es que si yo mantengo la Y acá, ah, perdón, va, va, mejor se los, voy a, se los voy a ilustrar. Si yo mantengo la Y y le agrego solamente ES, ya entonces pierde su función de vocal. Ya diría fly. Exacto. Entonces ya sería, sería fl yes. Fl yes. ¿Notan? Por eso es de que para mantener el sonido de la vocal se, se cambia la Y por I. Okay. O yeah. sea que en, en pocas palabras, eh, en el presente simple, cuando nos referimos a ella o él o alguna cosa, en cuanto a los verbos, siempre van a tener que llevar una S al final, por decirlo así. For he, she, and it, yes. O una 
E S. Yeah. Yeah. So you can add an S, mm -hmm. E S, or I E S. Okay. 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 Now, um, be careful because you don't change the the Y to an I for all the verbs. Because if you notice, play also finishes in a Y. Not that? But here, it's an S, not ES. And you don't, you keep the Y. You don't put, you don't change to an I. Why? What's the reason? It's because in this one, we have a consonant before. Here, there is a vowel. Regresamos a lo mismo que estábamos hablando hace un, hace un minuto. Aquí la Y hace función de consonante. Play. Entonces la A es la vocal. Pero acá, fly, la Y hace función de vocal. Porque no hay otra vocal. Entonces, por eso es de que esta no hay problema la podemos mantener porque hace la función, sigue con, siendo la función de consonante. Pero acá, si le ponemos la, si continuamos con la Y, aquí sí lo que va a pasar es de que va a cambiar su función. Y en vez de hacer una función de vocal, hace función de consonante. ¿Ok? ¿Does that make sense? Sí. Any questions? No question. You sure? No, que no questions at all? No. No? Okay. No. Va. Okay. As they say in Spanish, bueno, de hecho saben que voy a, antes que se me borre esto también voy a, a Tamarle captura de imagen para que podamos para no se usarlo. Okay. So, ¿las explicaciones han quedado claras? Sí, yes. Yes. It's clear for me. Yes. Perfect. Okay. Miren qué importante es que nos conectemos a clases todos los días. ¿Va? Porque esta es una clase. Esta, esta clase en particular, es una base del idioma inglés. Es una gran base del inglés. Si ustedes, um, si ustedes el día de hoy no se hubieran conectado, y si vienen agregados hasta, el próximo, hasta mañana, posiblemente estuvieran perdidos. Porque esto es bien importante. Entonces, qué bueno. Los felicito que se hayan conectado hoy. ¿Ok? Y así pueden hacer preguntas, ¿verdad? También porque a veces incluso puede ser que veamos el video, lo cual es muy bueno que vean el video cuando no, no logren conectarse. Pero el problema es de que cuando solo ve el video, a veces no tenemos esa oportunidad de preguntar. ¿Y esto por qué? ¿Y, eso por, por, y esto por qué no? ¿Va? Así que excelente. Ok. Can we start? Can we start? Um, eh, um, doing exercises? ¿Sí? Como dicen yeah. en inglés, manos a la obra. Espera, espera, en español, manos a la obra. Ok. All right. So, um, I'm going to send you in the group um, this exercise here. Um, please tell me if you can see. The exercise. See the exercise? 
چیزی هست بیشن یه اوکی پرفیکت All right, so we're going to do this exercise. It says, Paul Carter is talking about his family. Complete the sentence with the correct verb form, then compare with a partner. So he says, my family and I live in the suburbs. So you have to choose between live and lives. Okay, that's all you have to do. Okay. Um, so I'm sharing the content right now in the group. The exercise. Okay. And we're going to be working in pairs. Solo me voy a asegurar que todos están acá porque. Um, perfect. Okay. Eh, Brenda, are you there? Brenda Melissa? Brenda Melissa, ¿no se encuentra? Ok. <clears throat> bueno, entonces. Um, ok. Uh, we're opening the rooms right now. Hi, Lucas. How are you? Lucas, ¿está ahí? Lucas, can you hear me? Espérame que me está fallando esto. <risa> Hay que hacer una auditoría de calidad ahí porque no está bien. Okay. Okay. Are you ready? No, hombre, el, el monte que tenés atrás es el que te está haciendo interferencia. Ahí está ya. <laughs> No, hombre, no era el monte. <ríe> okay, listo. La señal está fallando. La señal visual, porque la auditiva sí está bien, va. Ahí está ya. Ahí. Yes. ¿Es eso, vos, o es un montaje? No, hombre, soy yo. Hay un <ríe> Estamos, pues, empecemos, pues. Dame empecemos. las respuestas, porque no tengo ni una. Espérame, voy a ver el, la fotografía que mandó la, la Dale, teacher. Pues. Mi familia... Ok, 
¿ok? Ok, ya la vi. Ok, very good. ¿Cómo está? ¿Cómo está la que viste? Difícil. <laughs> en inglés, ¿está? <laughs> ok, number one dice. My family and I in the suburbs. ¿Cuál sería ahí la respuesta? Según las opciones. Ahí, ahí hay unas opciones, ya las viste. Ajá, este. Es la que ya está contestada. Ya te... Sería. Este sí me, me pasé. Oh, ahí. Son doy. Doy. Nuestro hijo. Ajá. Don. Don. Drive. He rides his bike no. to school. Ajá, nuestro hijo no. No maneja, quiero decir, va. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Él. Right, con S al final. Right, ajá. Ajá. Uh -huh. Lo que me confundo, ¿qué significa right? Como monta bicicleta. Es como montar. paseo. ¿no? no, es montar bicicleta. Montar porque bicicleta. dice, monta right. su bicicleta a la escuela. O, oh, ajá. Uh -huh. mm, right. Ajá, cabal. Pasar en su bicicleta, algo así. Ajá. Uh -huh. right. Y la dos. My parents live. Live, ajá. Uh -huh. Y la S, solo live. Por favor, hombre. Live in the city. My mother takes. Mm. Ahí sí es take porque está hablando de. Creo que... No, no, porque no. si habla de el cake. Porque... Sí, porque está hablando de ella. Uh -huh, ella, ajá, como... Si fuera de plural, sí tendría que ser. Solo el cake. Uh -huh. Con ese, dice... entonces, cake. Sí, con ese. Y ahí, my father is. Retiro. Como... So, he. Doesn't. Doesn't. Ajá, doesn't. Como no puedo como se Work now. Y ahí sí, alto. Uses. Ajá. No, uses. Public transportation. So they don't. Ahí sí, don't. They don't use. Ajá, cabal, porque. Don't. Ajá, uh -huh. cabal. Yo estaba en el otro, me había perdido. No fue así. My parents live in the city. My mother takes a uh, train to work. Uh -huh. Y my father is retired. Así se pronuncia. No sé, creo que sí. Retired. Retire. So he don't or doesn't 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 work now. He als als also als also also use public transportation. So they don't don't. Uh -huh. New a car. Ajá. Uh -huh. estar resuelto? Yo creo que sí. Voy a anotar los falsos.
Hola. Hola Lucas. Hola. Este, solo en otro todo estamos, ¿o qué? Mm, no, nope, the whole class. Ah, no, okay. The whole class is here. Okay. All right. So we're going to check the answers. Are you guys ready? Ready. I'm ready. Excellent. Okay. Um, all right. Tell me if you can see my screen. Can, my, can you see my screen? Yes. yes. I see. Okay. Perfect. All right, so we're going to ch check the answers. So we know my family and I live in the suburbs. My wife and I. My wife work. and I. Work or works? Work. 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 Good. work. Good. Because work. it's we, right? We work near uh, here. So we work. Walk. Walk. We walk, walk. We walk to work. Our daughter Emily works work. 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 downtown. So she work. drives drives drive. to work. Drive. Our son does drive. does it because our does. son is he. As soon as he, so our son doesn't drive. He drive right his bike. His bike to school. Good. Okay. Questions? Yes, I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, my wife. Uh, and I work uh, because I, my wife, a reference to she. Sorry, I didn't understand the question. Can you repeat? Because we uh, work and my wife and in the first. The first one. My Pero wife que, and no I. Se refiere, no, se refiere a ella. no, my wife in Spanish. My, my esposa. Mi esposa. Y, and yo. I. Y yo. Y yo. Y so, yo. so, mi esposa y yo somos. Nosotros. Nosotros. And how do you say nosotros, nosotros, nosotros en inglés? We. we. So we. it would be we. we. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Let's continue then. Um my parents live live. 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 Good. My parents live in the city. My mother Take. Takes. Good. My mother takes a train to work. My father is retired. So he doesn't, doesn't, doesn't. doesn't work now. So we he sorry, he also uses uses. uses. He uses, he also uses public transportation. So they doesn't. doesn't. So they don't. 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 Remember, doesn't is only, 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 only used for he, she, she, and it. Okay? So for he, she, and it, then we can use doesn't or do. Or do. Okay? Do we understand? Only for these. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. All right, excellent.
let's stop that. And now we're going to be talking a little bit about, so we learned there about regular verbs, but now let's talk about irregular verbs. So irregular verbs do not have a rule. Irregular verbs are different because the word says they are irregular. So verbs, for example, like have. Okay. If have, if have was a regular verb, Im imagine that have was a regular verb, okay? Then in that case, we would say, so if, okay, sorry. If have was a regular verb, then we would say, I have, a, uh, blah, 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 blah. She has, blah, blah, blah. right? Correct. If 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 have was regular, but have is not regular. Have is irregular. Okay. So because have is an irregular verb. We are not going to be using she has, has, no. We say she has, okay? She has. So we say she has or he has or it has, and we use you, um, I have, you have, we have, they have, okay? Do we understand? No Is this clear? Is that clear, chicos? Yeah? Uh, so we're going to use has and just the the she he it right yeah the only the only one that suffers a change is she he and it and um uh, but uh, isn't a simple person in a simple present, correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you right. can you give me a, a other a other example, but change the verb? Mm, I don't understand the question. I don't understand the petition. Can you use a other other verb? verb? Uh, we are only looking at irregular verbs. So estamos viendo irregulares. Y yes, uno de esos yeah, irregulares is have. Uh, ahorita estamos, estamos viendo have. Vamos, vamos por etapa. Primero es just have. Okay? Do we, do we understand have? Yes. Okay, perfect. Bye. This is have. Now, next, we're going to talk about do, okay? Now we're going to talk about do. If do was a regular verb, if do was regular, imagine, imagine if it was regular, then we would say, for example, I do, she do, um, do's, do's, right? Yes? Así se diría if, 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 if it was regular, right? Sí? Chicos? No. No. Le estoy diciendo que si fuese regular, así ser, sería. Right? 
Right. Okay. Bye. Pero no es regular. Es el punto. No es regular. Si fuese regular, entonces fuera así. Pero no es regular. So, what we do is when we're talking about I or you or we or they, then we use do. So I do, you do, we do, they do. But when we're using she or he or it, it's not, it's not does, it's not does, it's does. So you say she does, he does, it does. Okay? Does that make sense? Yes? Hola. Yes. yes. Make sense? Tiene sentido? It makes sense? Yes, no, maybe. Chico, necesito, necesito, um, pues la palabra, um, Retroalimentación aquí. Estoy haciendo una pregunta. Does this make sense? ¿Tiene sentido? Yes. 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 Okay, good. Yes. All right, good. Now, we're going to do one more. Let's talk about go. Okay. So, imagine go was a regular verb. If go was a regular verb, then we would say, I, I go, and then for she, we would say, gos. Si fuera regular. Pero no es regular. It's irregular. Okay? So that means that with I and you and, sorry, and we and they, we use go. But for she and he and it, we use goes. Sounds good? Good. Yeah? <clears throat> sure. Okay. So that's why you say, I have a bike. My father has a car. We do our homework every day. My mother does a lot of work at home. My parents go to work by bus. The bus goes downtown. Okay? What is the difference okay. in the verb regular? Sorry? Sorry, I didn't hear your question. Can you repeat? Hello? Can we repeat the question? Se desconectó. No sé si se ha desconectado. Probably. Okay. Um, I'm going to take a picture here as well, or a screenshot, better said, and send it to the group so that you have something to look at.
to guide you. Okay. All right. So, um, all right, let's let's work on this together then. Um, okay. I'm going to share this, and we're going to do it together as a class. Do you see? Yes, do you see it or no? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Good. Good. All right. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Okay, so let's complete it here. My parents have a house in the suburbs. My mom and dad go or goes? Go. Go. All right. Go. Two people go. say go. Los demás? Go. Good. It's go because my mom and dad is they. They go. They go downtown to work. My parents are very busy. So I do or does? Do. I do. I do. I do a lot of work at home because, um, yeah, so it's I always goes with do. My brother doesn't live with us. He have or has? Good. Has. 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 Right. Has. Tiene, right. So he has an apartment in the city. So it's third person singular. So you say he has his apartment in the city. He go or he goes to school all day? Go. 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 He goes. He goes to school all day. And he do or he does office work. Does. 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 What? Does. 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 He does because it's third person singular. He does office does. work at night. I have or I has a new friend. I have. I have. I have. I have a new friend. His name is Jason. We go or we goes? We, we go. 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 We go because it's a, a first person plural. We go to the same school and sometimes we do or we does. Do. 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 We do. Mm -hmm. I put yeah, we do home our homework together. Okay. So, do we understand this, or do you have any questions you want to ask? I don't have a question. You don't have questions. No, I understand it. Oh, you understand it. Okay, all right, good. Okay, um, bueno, chicos, vamos a vamos a terminar allí. No, perdón, se me se me había escapado, no, no le tomé captura de imagen. Perdón, chicos. Okay, uh, so you have right now enough information to start uh, working on ex in unit one, okay? Um, um, yeah, so you should be able to do exercise, for it, uh, do unit one, okay? Um, de hecho, solamente antes de, yeah, um, Bueno, ya, ya ustedes um, ya tienen, ya les he dado toda la información que ustedes necesitan para completar eh, la, la unidad 1 o, o ajá, la sección 1 de la plataforma. 
Entonces, ¿cuándo vamos a tener clase otra vez? Solo para, para ver si todos... Mañana. Mañana. Mañana, muy bien. Ok, ahora, mañana vamos a tener clase, pero hoy quiero que quede terminada la unidad 1. Ok, porque ya, ten, ya hemos terminado lo que se necesita para la unidad 1. Entonces, okay. eh, ya para, para que mañana empecemos con la unidad 2. No sé si tienen alguna pregunta acerca de eso. No. No, no, teacher. No. Ok, perfecto. Okay, guys, in that case, that will be all for today, and I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? So, um, have a good day, uh, or better said, a good rest of your day, and I will see you tomorrow afternoon, okay? Okay, bye-bye, okay. see you later. All right, bye-bye, take care, everybody. Hoy no iba a pasar lista. Ay, perdón, perdón, sí, gracias, gracias, gracias por... Por, por recordarme de eso, se me había escapado ese detallito, sí, gracias. Ok, so we'll, we have uh, Brenda Melissa Linares. Present. Flor María Noyola. Present. José Ricardo Tesón. Present. Josué Ernesto Campos. Josué Ernesto Campos, ¿no? Carlos Sofía Nieto. Carla? Present. Present. Loida Eunice López. Present. Lucas eh, David Hernández. Present. Excellent. Luis Eduardo Castaneda. I'm here. Okay. Okay. Marcela del Carmen Pozo. Present. Excellent. Marcos Antonio Torres. Marcos, Marcos Antonio Torres. No. Eh, María Violeta Cañada María Violeta eh, Mario Edgardo Contreras Mario, Mario Edgardo Contreras okay. Melqui Adonías Rivas Melqui Eso se desconectó Ok, um, uh, quiero ver con Nuria Marilu de Monroy, uh, Ricardo Antonio Molina, present, excellent, Sandra María Chávez, present, excellent, William Ernesto Riana, present, present, excellent, Jensi Lizeta Abrego, Yancy, Yesenia Patricia Pérez, Yesenia Patricia Pérez, y Jonathan Guillermo Segueda. Ok, hoy sí, chicos. Entonces, hoy sí, ya, ya oficialmente terminamos. <laughs> ok, so have a good rest of your afternoon, and I will see you tomorrow. Good tomorrow afternoon. Ok. See you. Good All afternoon. Right. Bye. Bye-bye. Have, have a good evening, Bye. everybody. Bye. Bye.